What's up comic book readers? Welcome to Too Many Comics. I'm your host Eric and today we are taking a look at a title first published by Wildstorm and now published by Dynamite. The Boys, Volume 1, The Name of the Game, written by Garth Ennis and drawn by Derek Robertson. The story is Ennis's attempt to look up at what superheroes would be in the real world. His assumption is that they would be a cross between politicians who have an actual effect on our world and famous pop culture celebrities who are well known, recognized and followed. The book takes its name, The Boys, from the CIA back team specializing in keeping an eye on the superhero population. In fact, they are the guys you go to when the soups get out of the line. This team is led by Billy Butcher who the CIA claims to be the most lethal individual ever encountered by the agency. Under his command we have Wee Yui, the last recruited member, Mother's Milk, Frenchman and the female, who despite her look is physically the most dangerous member on the team. The first arc begins when Wee Yui's girlfriend is killed in a superhero battle as collateral damage. Yui will be approached by Butcher and will reveal to be the reader's eyes and way into the story as he learns more about the organization as well as the super teams. The prime of them all being the Seven. With every member meant to be a superhero archetype, we will soon learn that most superheroes are pretty much the lowest and filthiest scums there is. We will learn about how the super teams operate, who backs the different organizations and how they are kept in line. While The Boys is about superheroes, it has very little resemblance to mainstream comics. Robertson's art style is much more suited to street level action and drama, giving the superheroes a somewhat ridiculous look instead of a godlike appearance. The presentation proposes a much more grounded feel as the violence is explicit, bringing the focus on the pain and horrors committed rather than the prowesses of the superheroes. To say the least, this series is not for everybody. It is brutal, it is harsh, but if you like to walk on the dark path of humor, to think and read a new approach to the underside of superheroes, I highly encourage you to go to your local comic book store and dig down into the boys. Well this is it for this video and until next time, Keep on reading.